Hey guys, welcome back to Gauntlet Dark Legacy. My name is Brian, your host and commentator here on this 100% completion walkthrough. Uh, we just finished up the Haunted Cemetery, now we're about to enter the Mausoleum, the final level of this world. Sad to see this world go, I really like it. Horror theme for the win. But that's fine. There's another, uh, the last level, actually, or the last world, I mean, before you do the final boss shit, you know, is actually really good, so. It's cool that you get to start off the game with a really good world and then end it with a really good world, too. <coughs> At least in my opinion. <coughs> Those ghosts are not scary. Yay! Levitation! Woo! So the mausoleum can get kind of confusing. I'm going to do my best to guide you through it. Uh, let's cut left here first. Yeah, another reason I decided to do this game was I looked online. There really aren't that many guides for it. Like, some of them just don't have any commentary, which is fucking boring if you ask me. I don't know how people watch that kind of stuff. But maybe some people just don't like the commentary. I don't know. I can break this wall right here. Get another switch. Woo! A potion! I don't know if... Oh yeah, this this came up. That's right, that's where those enemies came up from. Okay, Ugh. anyway. So yeah, uh, I only saw like two like full walkthroughs that I could... like. One, one was no commentary, one was commentary. The rest were like reviews and just like how to defeat the bosses and stuff. There's no like solid walkthrough for it and the uh, the walkthrough I, I watched just seemed like it was just a casual like I watched a couple episodes and it just seemed like a casual playthrough of the game it wasn't really a walkthrough of sorts you know it wasn't revealing everything for the the viewer so that's my I guess that's my goal is to kind of make a decent walkthrough kind of like Alan Wake like I went online and I didn't see like a decent Alan Wake walkthrough where it was 100% completion showed you where everything was you know walked you through everything whoa I just bump the mic. So I went and did an Alan Wake walkthrough, you know, and it turned out, whoops, I accidentally skipped that, it turned out really well, and it's, I don't know, it's not one of my more popular walkthroughs, but The Evil Within is definitely my most popular one, it's brought a lot of people to this channel. Uh, Dark Souls seems to be doing okay as well. My Outlast, oh, <sighs> stupid poison fruit. Outlast one seems to be doing okay. I don't know, I just like to do walkthroughs based on just kind of how I'm feeling at the time, you know? What, uh, that's how I started a lot of them. That's what this was originally going to be, like my fourth walkthrough. I think I was I mentioned that in the first episode or something like that. It's going to be like my third or fourth. I think I was going to do it. Uh, I think it was going to be my third. I was going to do it after Alan Wake. Damn it! I got to use my X-ray glasses more. I was going to do it before or after Alan Wake was finished, but I couldn't find the game. I was going to do it on PlayStation 2 as well. I'm glad I waited because I'd rather do it on GameCube. And I'm just glad I waited because I wasn't really prepared to do the game. If that makes any sense. I just kind of wanted to do it because I really felt like it. Like, that's... Other games were, uh... Let's see here. What other games did I plan? Uh... Oh, no, wait. I think I was going to do it after Donkey Kong Country. Either way, it was going to be my third or fourth, and now it's my twelfth walkthrough that I'm doing for the channel. But, yeah, other games, like... I, well, I planned Banjo-Kazooie. I, I always told myself, I was like, yeah, the first one I'm going to do is Banjo-Kazooie. It's got to be. It's a simple game. It's one of my favorites all time. I love it. I gotta take care of this guy really quick. Oh, move! Let's see, I got a Phoenix, X ray, levitation, anti death, speed, gas mask, can of death, Phoenix. Okay, looks like I'm going Phoenix. Ah, I gotta use a potion. There we go. Nailed him with that. Killed him. Nice. Yeah, we're getting pretty strong now. Level 12. Is it? Like I said, we'll be like level, I think, 15 by the end of this. Walking out of here. Ah! Jesus. I don't know what's going on, but I couldn't move and I was not hitting him. I'll save my Phoenix. Uh, what's in here? Oh, it was junk. I thought it was gold. Whatever, I'll take junk, I guess. It all adds up in the end, I suppose. I don't know, we'll see. I'll just use my levitation. Because I don't want it. Speed, gas mask, hand of death. Let's see where death is. Somewhere over there. I 
This guy's just like biding his time. He's like, one of these days I'm gonna throw a bomb. I'm waiting for that right moment. Right moment, Randy. That's what that orc, not orc, that zombie was called. We fight orcs in the next world. Alright. Oh god, come on, just die. Jesus. Grab this crystal and this crystal and break that for some keys. Don't want to blow up those keys. Boom, hand of death is gone. What's over here? A key. <laughs> Getting a lot of keys. Uh, let me wear my gas mask. I think you can sell the gas mask. Didn't I sell a gas mask earlier? I could have sworn I did. Right, X ray. Ooh, lightning shield. I'll take it. Definitely. Or electric armor, whatever it is. Pretty good stuff. Uh, I'll have the Phoenix on. I'll put the Phoenix on deck and we'll just go from there. I'm actually just flying through this level. I feel like this level took a felt like it took a lot longer in my other uh, playthrough, but I guess I kind of know it now. Like it's not as it's a bit more fresh, you know, compared to when I last played it. Light amulet. Break that. Let me access the switch. What's that gonna do? Oh, it's gonna lower that. A bunch of crystals on it. Red ones that I don't need. I guess we need blue for the next area. I don't think it's blue. I thought it was something else. Maybe it is blue. God, just get them. There we go. Monsters are a little bit stronger, the ghosts. That is. Apple. I have plenty of keys. I have seven keys. Wow. Oh, no. Oh. Ah. Anti-death. Anti-death. Ah. Ah. Ho, 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 ho. Get back here. Ooh, where are you going? Let me kill these guys really quick. Ooh, come here, Death. Come here. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> I was like tickling him in the corner. That's how I view it. I was tickling him. Not raping him. I was tickling him. Give him a piece of his own medicine. Alright, let's grab this potion and then blow up the barrel. Grab this key before I forget it. Speed, rapid fire, weapon, phoenix, x-ray. Let me... I'm gonna bust out the phoenix. I'm getting tired of all this shit. Yeah, don't worry. We're still going down there. You can see the level exits down there. And there's some meat right there. We'll grab that in a second. Go ahead and use that. Let's see what this has to say. On the altar, much has been given to honor scorn. Interesting. Whoa, Jesus. No idea what happened right there. Ooh, turbo! Because that's a fucking awesome item to get. Everybody wants turbo. Damn. These guys are strong. Alright, looks like we're going all the way up here. Oh yeah, you can break this wall. I thought there was a breakable wall around here. I was like, it seems like there's a breakable wall around here from my memory. From my memory! Yeah, the only, uh... Special item we're getting in this level is a rune stone. So far, every level has had a special like thing to it, you know. Like the first level had a rune stone, the second one had a hidden character, third one had the parchment of fire, a legendary item or weapon. This one has a rune stone. Next one's a boss fight, which the rune stone is actually right behind this door right here. So fun fact: two rune stones, extra speed. I probably should have saved that. Not worth the cherry, but I'll take it. Ugh. Come on. I don't want to hit the, the barrel because I want that potion. There we go. Ah. I gotta use the, <laughs> I gotta use the potion. <laughs> Jesus. It was falling apart. I didn't know what to do. I was like, ah. I don't want to skip over this barrel here. Nothing! Alright. Let's just continue along, shall we? Whoop his ass. 
destroy that, kill him, break those, grab the meat, routine stuff. Uh, kicking maggot piles. It's in the job. It's all part of the job. I don't know if you can break this corner. Nope. Doesn't look like it. Oh, come on. Okay, we got another scroll. Beware of the treasures found with ease. It's warning us of some trap, I'm sure. <laughs> well, I guess we'll go back for that green crystal. Now that it's worth it. I think they unlock the forest realm. If I'm not mistaken, the forest realm is what the green is used for. Uh, the realms in order are the Forsaken Province, which is uh, where we're at right now. Then the Mountain Kingdom, which is like fire based or whatever. This is undead themed. That one's mountain, I don't know, fire, lava themed. Uh, the third one is the Castle Stronghold, which is castle themed. Fortress themed, or whatever, however you want to look at it. The fourth one is the Sky Dominion. Uh, that's like poison themed, I guess. Poison's a theme. It's not swamp, it's poison, you know, it's weird. Let me take care of this generator. There we go. Alright, now we'll deal with all this. So, what was I saying? Sky Dominion, after the Sky Dominion is the... Oh, I think this is that treasure chest that it was talking about. Yeah, we were a tra treasure found with these. It's a bomb. Bomb diggity. Fuck, what's after the... Let me see if I can remember. Uh, oh, it's the forest. Yeah, it's the forest realm. Forest realm. Then the desert lands, and then the ice domain, and then the dream, dreamland or whatever, dream realm, something like that. And then you fight the boss. You do all the boss, end game stuff. Uh, here I'll have rapid fire on deck. I gotta be careful with that. I'm just throwing that thing around all willy nilly. Great, fe great bounty, bounty. Great bounty can be found within the hallowed chapel. The hallowed chapel. Okay. Longer level. We are now almost 13 minutes into this level. I think we're getting. We're doing pretty good, though. I think as far as progress goes, I think we, we're definitely past halfway through the level. Uh, I don't know how far past really that was the thing. So this is definitely one of the longer levels. All these levels in this first world are a bit longer. I don't know. It's whatever. It's whatever, you know. So be careful about what you're doing. Don't grab that chest. I think it's a bomb, if I remember correctly. So don't grab the chest. If you do, you're going to end up blowing up all this stuff behind it. Let's see. Maggot. And, of course, there's gems, which I don't think will be effective, but you'll lose the gold and the watermelon. And let me just confirm whether or not this is a bomb. That's a bomb. Okay. I like a lot of midway games. I really do. I can get down on it. Like Gauntlet, you know, they were publishing Mortal Kombat back in the day. I think they had a they had something to do with Pac-Man too. Like they had a huge or Miss Pac-Man, I think it was. Something like that, you know, they I don't know. I'm trying to think of other games Midway has. They have a bunch though. There's a bunch that Midway did before they went bankrupt. Did I ah, oh, I was hoping I would oh I guess I, I could <laughs> Could have just attacked it like that. Let me see what's in this chest. Before we go any further, I have eight keys. Oh, it's meat. All right, I'll take it. Since I have so many keys. Do do, epic music. All right, crystal, crystal. God, this game is so high school for me. Well, I mean, it was not high school. It was, I guess it was more like middle school. Late middle school, early high school. 
or maybe middle school. I don't know. GameCube came out in 2001, right? I think it was. All right, what am I going to use to fight him? Uh, rapid fire, weapon, turbo. I do have my turbo. Let me use my turbo. Right, I'll hit him with one of those. Oh, turbo up. I should have waited. I could have got another one. Uh, weapon, rapid fire, speed. Probably could just... Here, I'll go rapid fire. Yeah, electric armor or the uh, lightning shield. If you run into enemies, it like zaps them, I think. Something like that. X-ray. Bomb! Haha! -ha. Nice try. Nice try. I think there is a breakable wall around here somewhere, though. <coughs> Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe it's... Oh, okay, yeah, I thought so. I was like, man, I really think there is. Just a cherry, though. Okay. Whatever. Whatever. This is good. We're going to need a bunch of keys uh, in these next few levels in the Mountain Kingdom. Because they get... Mountain Kingdom gets pretty pretty crazy about key usage. You'll end up using a lot of keys there. I don't know why. I think the Castle Stronghold has a fair amount of key use as well. Oh, shit. Alright, we're getting close to the end of the level. I think we're heading towards the last area. Final areas. Let's go down. Maggots! Uh, uh. Yeah, see, now we're going back down. What you do is you start down low, and then you go up, and then you go back down. This is a gigantic mausoleum. This place is fucking huge. Take care of all those guys. Nothing there. Okay. That's a poison barrel. Okay, yeah, that was a very very well-placed uh, special, if I do say so myself. Kick these guys. Uh, uh, uh. Get out of here. Uh, uh. Just kick all your shit. Kick your fucking home. Kick your face. Get him. Get him. Uh, level 14. Oh, yeah. Oh, maybe. Maybe we'll only be level 14. I thought we'd be 15. Could be wrong. Shit, that's a lot of guys. Uh, fuck it. Just use it. Don't even care at this point. Still have three potions. I've been managing my my items pretty pretty well. Oh my. Oh, we got another one of those guys, huh? X-ray, electric armor, anti-death, speed, weapon, X-ray. All right, weapon. We'll go weapon. Light amulet. I think the lich is really weak against light. All these guys are really weak against light, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, there's the end of the level. We're close. Uh. Sit down. You know what? I'll just use this weapon for the end of the level. Hit the switch, lower that. There's a breakable wall behind the portal. Only a fool would face the lich without the good book. Even the game is warning us of it. So like I said, we're gonna it's gonna be a minute before we uh, face the lich, so just a heads up. Let's go ahead and do that. Did we miss the We might have missed the switch for Where's the switch at? For that. Hold on. Not complete this level without finding that switch. Where is it? It's gotta be somewhere over here. Oh man. What? This sucks. I really don't want to do this right now. Hold on, let's go. I'll go back here. There it is. Yeah. There it is. Sneaky. 
Sneaky switch. Sneaky ass switch. All right, I'll use my speed to catch back up. <laughs> Get back over there. Waste enough time. 20 minutes here. Gold, well worth it. Speed, X-ray, electric armor, anti-death. That's all I have. Okay, let's get out of here now. Woo! Ooh, I have a notification on my phone. I have a lot of notifications. A lot of Facebook notifications. I'll look at those after this episode is done recording. Uh, okay. Level 14, not bad. Not bad. Level 14. I don't remember if I'm level 15 or 14 my other character. I'll have to see because that's gonna depend. I'll do a little bit of comparis comparing. Comparing. <laughs> is almost what I said. <clears throat> you can sell the electric shield. I think I might do that. We'll see. No, I'll keep it. I'll keep the electric shield. Keeping those. Keep an anti-death. That's pretty much what I, I want to keep the anti-death and the x-rays. Those are like the ones you want to keep. So let's get another 5 to strength here and... I'll heal up a little bit more. <laughs> I don't know. All right. Boom. Looking good. All right, so now I'm done leveling up strength for a little bit. Now I gave myself a good boost to that. Woohoo! Oh, yeah. So, um... Yeah, that's... Pretty much completed the the Forsaken Province. We do have the boss fight, which is this final portal to the right here. Uh, he's gonna place another rune stone for us, really quick. You have found a rune stone. Woo! We got both the yellow ones. Actually, I don't know how many there are of each color. But uh, anyway, yeah. So I don't know. That's. That's it. That's gonna be that's gonna be it for this episode. Next episode, we're gonna head over to the Mountain Kingdom, and we'll uh, clear a couple levels over there. We'll get started. We'll do work on that that world next. We'll come back to the Lich probably halfway through the game to fight him once we get the Good Book, which is in the fourth world. So, anyways, thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to leave a like, comment, and please consider subscribing to the channel. My name is Brian, and hopefully, I'll see you in the next one. Peace.